This summer, the Netherlands and Denmark will send 14 Leopard 2 tanks to Ukraine, which they previously purchased for the Ukrainian armed forces. This was stated by the Minister of Defense of the Netherlands, Ruben Breckelmans. Over the past few months, the tanks have been repaired and tested. Last year, the Netherlands and Denmark bought 14 used Leopard 2A4 tanks, which were refurbished by the German company Rainmetal. Therefore, Ukraine will be able to fully use them in the war with Russia. This week, the last two Leopard 2 tanks are undergoing control tests. At the same time, the first 12 tanks are already ready to be sent to Ukraine. All 14 tanks will be delivered simultaneously by the end of summer 2024. The head of the Dutch Ministry of Defense noted that given the heavy fighting on the front, Ukraine urgently needs more military support. According to him, these 14 tanks can play an important role for the armed forces of Ukraine in defending against Russian troops. The Netherlands, together with its allies and partners, will continue to support Ukraine for as long as necessary. This is essential to protect Ukraine and deter Putin's aggression, said Dutch Defense Minister Ruben Breckelmans. The Defense Ministry recalled that the Netherlands is part of an international tank coalition that supplies Ukraine with modern combat tanks. As part of the coalition, Ukraine is also being equipped with Leopard 1 tanks. Denmark and Germany are participating in this project. Spain is also helping Ukraine by donating 10 Leopard 2A4 tanks, with plans for additional deliveries in the future. As noted, the multimodal transportation of 10 Leopard 2A4 battle tanks to Ukraine has begun, having undergone the process of repair, adjustment and readiness at the Santa Barbara Sistemas plant in Alcala de Guadera, as well as the corresponding tests to verify their full functionality. The department noted that a new batch of aid will arrive in Poland this weekend, after which they will be delivered to the Ukrainian military. The armed forces of Ukraine will be responsible for the final stage of movement across Ukrainian territory until it is made available to operational units of the Ukrainian army, the statement said. European Union wants to replace Russian gas with Azerbaijani gas while maintaining transit through Ukraine. The European Union is negotiating with Baku and Kiev on the supply of Azerbaijani gas through the territory of Ukraine. Bloomberg reports this. The publication claims that the leaders of the European Union made a personal request to Ilham Aliyev. Ukraine and the European Union have approached Baku with a proposal to supply natural gas to Europe through Ukraine after the current contract with Russia expires at the end of this year. The publication quotes the words of the Azerbaijani leader emphasizing that Russia is also involved in the negotiation process. Talks continue with the authorities in Ukraine and the EU as well as with Russia and all sides seem to be interested in continuing the supplies, Aliyev said at a conference in the town of Shusha. We will help if we can, he said. Despite the fact that all parties are interested in continuing the supply, of Russian gas to Europe, the negotiations are not proceeding simply because of the position of Kyiv, which regularly threatens its European neighbours with stopping the transit of Russian gas after the end of the current contract. A deal to replace Russian gas with Azerbaijani supplies is one of the proposals currently being discussed. The president of Ukraine, who has lost his legitimacy, said in an interview with Bloomberg, let us recall that after the start of the military operation of the Russian Federation in Ukraine, a number of European states tried to refuse Russian gas. However, this turned out to be not so easy. Part of Europe continues to receive Russian fuel in transit through Ukraine, while other states purchase Russian gas from Turkey. The EU and Azerbaijan signed a Memorandum of Understanding for a Strategic Partnership in Energy on July the 18th, 2022. Azerbaijan, which has historically exported natural gas only to Georgia and Turkey, extended its export base to seven countries with the addition of five European nations. EU leaders describe Azerbaijan, which exports 50% of its natural gas to Europe, as a reliable partner and pan-European gas supplier. Azerbaijan exports natural gas to Italy, Greece, Bulgaria, Romania and Hungary. 
However, Serbia, Albania, Bosnia and Herzegovina, Montenegro, Croatia, Slovakia and North Macedonia are also expected to begin gas purchases from Azerbaijan in the future.